There comes the popo. <laughs> Alright, what are these kids doing? They're going duck hunting, officer. Last year, I think I know that eight point from a couple years ago. Good to know that nobody killed him last year. Got up this morning about 2:30. It was a early start. Couldn't get out here until we got to the spot at 5:30. Whenever I get up in the morning, I normally wake up, let the dog out, load all my stuff in my car, go out, hit a gas station, get some gas station snacks and energy drink, and drive out to the spot. kind of like how duck hunting is. It's a lot of walking, a lot of driving, a lot of miles on the car for pretty much nothing most of the time. Birds just ain't here uh, this early in the year. I don't know why I duck hunt. Maybe it's because the ducks taste good, but it's just nice being out in nature, being away from all the people. But I don't know. But all my family up north, they hunt. So it's kind of in my DNA, I guess, to get out here. I always had a call to the wilderness. So I guess that's why I do it. I'm not thinking about anything whenever a group of ducks come in. I'll be thinking about work and life whenever there's nothing going on. But as soon as I see a group of ducks or I hear that wing beat, or I hear them quacking, everything just kind of goes away. And I am 100% focused on that group of birds and trying to get that group of birds into the decoys. It is probably the most relaxing thing that I do. And it takes away all the stress in life, all the thoughts about everything. It's just very primal seeing those birds. It's very exciting. I got one, put in my gun jam. I think a lot of people don't know about hunting. I mean, they think about it, but they don't think that it's something that they'll get into and really enjoy. Um, natural harvest of game. Because um, a lot of people the majority of America, 90% probably, just buys their food from the grocery store. They don't know how it's uh, processed or anything like that. Uh, I worked on a farm for about five years, so I was very in touch with how food is grown, animals are taken care of, uh, all that. So I 
got a good base of knowledge and understanding on where food comes from. And I don't think a lot of people realize that. They just think food comes from the grocery store. It's a lot of work coming duck hunting because you got to wake up early. I'll wake up at 2.30 every morning to come duck hunting. And a lot of the spots that I go to are about a mile walk from the car. And you're carrying, you know, 60 pounds of gear with you. Um, and if you shoot a limit of mallards or something, you know, you're walking out with another 25, 30 pounds of birds. So uh, it's a lot of hard work doing duck hunting. It ain't easy. I mean, we got mud all around us. My feet are sucked down to my ankles in mud just sitting in the blind. Yeah, but I mean, most of the time, whenever you're duck hunting, at least down here, um, you don't shoot a lot of birds. I mean, you're not limiting it out every time. We shot one duck today. Um, probably not going to shoot anymore. Most of the time, you're not shooting limits. Doing all this work for just one duck doesn't bother me. Uh, I enjoy eating duck. I enjoy the process even though it's hard. Duck hunting is something that I'll never not do. I'll uh, be doing this till the day I die, no matter how difficult it is, or no matter how low the duck population gets, so we can only kill one duck a day. Uh, it's just something that I've grown to love, and that I ain't never gonna change.